Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. My name's Gemma and if you're new here don't forget to hit the subscribe button and don't forget to check out a video I did a couple of days ago where you can take part in a Christmas giveaway that I'm running at the moment and actually um, tomorrow is the last day that you can enter that so FYI quickly head on over to that video subscribe to the channel click like on the video and send me a comment that's all you have to do to enter Anyway, um, if my voice sounds a bit funny, I haven't been too well over the last um, few days. Feeling a bit better today, but I've just been chilling out today. And I thought, what could I film for Vlogmas? It's getting a bit late on in the day, so this video is probably going to go up late again. Um, but I'm going to film for you, um, just showing you what I got for my birthday, I thought. Because it was my birthday on Friday, so that was two days ago. Um, so I thought I'd show you some of the gifts that I received from my friends and family. So the first gift I got was an electric toothbrush. And you might think that this is a bit of a weird present to receive for your birthday. Um, but I've been having some problems with my teeth or in particular one tooth. Now I, I did do a vlog about this but I didn't actually, I haven't put it up yet. I don't know if I'm going to put it up. I went to the dentist after not going for about 17 years. I literally have not been to the dentist since I was a child. You all might be shocked and disgusted at this because <laughs> I know a lot of people I've told about it are. They're like, OMG Gemma, you've not been to the dentist, how disgusting or whatever um, and I just didn't go because when I was um, a teenager I had to have like four teeth taken out because I had too many for my jaw or my jaw was too small for the amount of teeth that you're supposed to have and then um, there was like problems I mean tooth, my teeth were a bit crooked so I had braces on there and it was like a horrendous experience in those days anyway it was awful um, and I decided I didn't want to go to the dentist ever again until I had a problem with my teeth and then recently I've been feeling like sensitive teeth my teeth have been I've never had any problems all through my adult life I have recently been having a bit of sensitivity in my teeth um, and my gums have been sort of hurting and I just felt like there might be a problem so I got myself some of that cortisol mouthwash and attempted to treat it myself but in the back of my mind I was thinking about gum disease and stuff like that so I thought you're gonna have to go to the dentist before like all of your teeth drop out so I went to the dentist this is about a month ago now and he found a big cavity in my wisdom tooth up here which had never hurt whatsoever I didn't even out of all the teeth I thought there could be a problem with I didn't imagine it would be that one and he poked about in there said I had an x-ray and they said I'd, it couldn't be fixed I'd have to have it taken out but I've got to wait for that um and now it kills actually from off from time to time since he's poked about in it it hurts quite a bit and I can't eat on that side or anything so not a fan of a dentist. Anyway, they also said I might have like early starts of gum disease. Just telling you that on my birthday haul video. Um, but they're not quite sure. They just said my gums look, looked inflamed and they needed cleaning like in between because I'd never been to have like a hygienist appointment. So I had one of them and I've got to have another one. I have a next month for the month after, I think. And then they'll be able to tell whether it is gum disease and whatever they're going to do, keep cleaning it I suppose. So I got myself this toothbrush anyway, look it's very fancy. Um, it's rose gold um, and it's it was 80 something pounds which is like mega expensive for a toothbrush but I know it was reduced um, from 200 and something which is ridiculous. It does loads of fancy stuff. Comment down below if you want me to do an unboxing and demo of this toothbrush and I will do it. I'll probably do it anyway actually. Um, so that's that. Another thing I got for my birthday was this um, bedding, Christmas bedding. Some people who have December birthdays like me don't like getting Christmas gifts for their birthday but I actually don't mind um, and I wanted some new Christmas bedding and I didn't manage to get any this year um, so I've, my mum bought me this and it's got really cute reindeers on and you can also have it white or red so that's really handy. It's really nice. It's from TK Maxx. She's left the price and it was $16.99. Next present I got um, was off one of my friends, Isabel. Actually, you know Isabel. 
She, I just opened these to show you. She got me these beautiful little earrings. They're really nice and like dainty, which I like sort of dainty ones. And yeah, they are that sort of clasp, which I don't think I've ever had before. It like opens like that. So they're like tiny little hoops. Um, Hang on. Tiny little hoops like that and with this nice little pointy bit on and um, they're in like, you can't really see them as I'm holding them up. I'll show them better in the, inside the box. So they're in like a rose gold colour which is really nice, I really like rose gold um, and they're really pretty aren't they? They were from a company called Astrid and Mayu which I've never heard of before but they're really pretty and the packaging is super cute in this little box. My other friend Jenny got me um, this gin, she knows I like gin, I haven't opened it yet. I was going to drink it on my birthday, um, but I didn't. Oh, the glass is really nice, I can hold a big glass of gin, which is just what I like. Um, it says Gordon's Shall We on it, and it's got like a pink um, like ombre effect on the handle. And then you get the pink gin with it, a little pink gin. This is what this is what I'm interested in. What on earth are these? Wow, they're like dried berries that you can put in the gin. I don't know if you can eat them or you can just distill them in the gin. But they're pretty interesting, aren't they? Pretty cool. <clears throat> I also got some chocolate, some um Belgian white chocolates, gin and flay oh the cookies. Um Belgian white chocolate, gin and tonic, all butter cookies. They sound interesting. Um can I open them? They look really nice, don't they? And I also got some chocolate. Now my one of my favourite flavours ever is Black Forest Gatto. Um, Black Forest Gatto is my favourite cake in the whole wide world. And now Fortin's do this chocolate. It says it's 70% dark chocolate and it's got cherry and almond pieces. It, it sounds really scrumptious. Oh, my mum got me this little Christmas decoration. It's not bent there. Um, this little Christmas decoration. And it's a suitcase um, because I'm hoping to go on my holidays this year and actually go abroad. I don't know if I've announced this on the channel yet. Shall this be an actual exclusive? I'm hoping to go actually to America for my first ever abroad holiday this year. Or it'll be next year in 2019. Um, so hope, touch wood, fingers crossed if all goes to plan, which I'm hoping it will. Um, I'll be going to New York and other places with my friend Isabel. Um, so that's exclusive for this video. I, I don't think I've told you about it anyway. It's like a recent thing anyway. Um, but I'm super excited because obviously I've never been abroad and I just wanted to go somewhere where I've always wanted to go to rather than just go on a holiday to like Spain or something. And Not that I wouldn't enjoy it but Obviously, I've waited this long to go abroad. I want it to be really spectacular, and I think it's going to be. So, my mum got me this little suitcase. Um, it's a Christmas tree or, uh, decoration. I'm going to pop it on my tree. Um, and she also gave me some money as well as a gift. Um, and I'm going to put that money in my savings account, which I'm going to open after Christmas, um, to save up for my holidays. So, thank you, mum. Oh, I forgot... I forgot to show you, I also got this rug for my birthday. Um, it's like a fluffy rug, it was from B&Q. Um, I haven't put it down yet, so I can't really show it to you properly. I just thought I'd add this in. My sister and my niece went to Pandora. I actually spent most of my birthday with my sister and my niece. Um, I stayed over at their house. And we had like a lovely meal. And um, I just want to try and show you, because I've actually put it on. My bracelet, the Pandora charm they got for me, and it's that one there. Hopefully you can see it, I'll just wait to see if the camera focuses in on that. It's actually Mary Poppins' bag. It actually says Mary Poppins on the bottom. Um, and it's her um, 
carpet bag and I really love this charm. I actually, it's a really weird story because I didn't actually see this charm on the website until like the night before my birthday and I thought, oh, if anyone gives me any money for my birthday, I might go into Pandora and um, buy this charm and then I was super surprised when I opened my sister's gift and saw it was this because I think it's fairly new to Pandora. I don't know if the camera's doing this justice or you can see it very well. I'll try and enclose some like promotional pictures of it because they do a much better job of um, photographing the product than I ever could. What else did I get for my birthday? It's my birthday. Um, I, I got some Lush gifts. I got um, the Magic Wand review, reusable bubble bar, which I think I've had this one before. I haven't had anything from Lush this Christmas. Yeah, I've definitely had this one before. I remember it last year. So, actually, I think this is on my thumbnail last, last year. <laughs> this smells delicious. I love Snow Fairy. Um, it's one of my favourite scents from Lush. Uh, they also got me a little Snow Fairy gift where you get a Snow Fairy jelly bomb and a Snow Fairy shower gel. And it's all wrapped up in this beautiful paper. These make excellent Christmas gifts, really. Um... Especially if you can't be bothered wrapping people's presents up because they come so beautifully packaged. I got vouchers. I got Debenhams vouchers off my grandma and obviously I got money off my mum. Um, oh, and then off my other friend, um, I got a, a lovely cup, a Little Miss mug. It says, Little Miss Birthday enjoys every day because every day is someone's birthday. A Little Miss Birthday loves presents. <laughs> um, that's quite cute, isn't it? Uh, so there's this cup, Little Miss Birthday, and it says that little rhyme on the back as well. And that was really cute, and I do love cups, they're one of my favourite things to buy. They also got me these super cool socks, um, Cockney Spaniel apparently they're from. Um, and they are, they look like, I'll take them out of the thing now. They are, they look like they're like Converse shoes, don't they? And on the back they're like that. So they're really cool as well. Thank you. Um, I think that's all the presents I got for my birthday, which is not just all, there's, there's been a lot of presents. Um, thank you to everybody that wished me a happy birthday on that video that I did, um, where I showed you another birthday gift I got off Hamstar. Um, and thank you for everyone that said they hoped I got better soon. Um, it's just unfortunate, like, I'm off on annual leave. This is my last few days of being off from work, and I still feel a bit poorly, but never mind. Anyway, take care, and thanks for watching, and I'll see you again real soon. Bye-bye!